Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Season 7, Episode 19 of Arrow Called Spartan. So we're going to start off with the storm where there's a shady deal going down, but Oliver is on it with Spartan and they managed to, uh, the guy managed to escape, but they did get the drive that the guy was selling. And so they're looking for Emiko and then we have a fight scene and... Like I said, it's a drive from Argus. Then we cut to where Felicity accidentally almost fried the drive because it's from Defense Intel and not strictly from Argus. So Oliver and Diggle go to the DIA and talk to Mr. Stewart, <laughs> who won't help because it's classified. And it's John's stepdad, and Diggle is very icy towards him. <laughs> very icy towards him. And um, then we get to a flash forward scene where the helmet is fried and need a power module to fix it. Then we go to um, the present day where this guy named Madness, who's pump, has like Madness Lacor or something, wants to buy Archer. Then we cut to there's a trader alert and the knights show up and steal Archer. And um, but the army uh, or the DIA drop in and try to help, but they still stole it. Then we cut to where Diggle is still being icy towards Stuart. <laughs> and basically, um, Stuart starts securing the assets. And basically, we found out that Diggle's um, dad was um, Stuart's CO. And he blames him because of a mission he got everyone else except for the dad. And he practiced a lot of tough love, like living in the woods. And telling him to get out without using a compass and that type of thing. Then we cut to the flash forward scene where the galaxy guy is in desperate territory and so the um Mia's friend who is John Diggle's stepson meets JJ who is John J Diggle Jr. And then we go to the present day where Dinah and Renee talk and then we cut to one guy is um unaccounted for so they go to location and basically they busted his op <laughs> and then we cut to where Diggle and Stuart got taken and then we cut to where Felicity can't try Diggle or Stuart and so Diggle and Stuart are now awake and the guy tortures both of them then Felicity got um Stuart's file and basically the mission that um Diggle was talking about was a lie then we cut to where the guy again starts torturing Stuart, then Diggle, this sort taught. And so then he learned, then he found the way to break out by using that shoelace, which he's very, very clever. Then we cut to where Felicity got a signal because they boosted the um, signal in his helmet to the electric stick that, yeah, that the, that the guy used. Then we cut to where Felicity uh, got. Uh, Diggle out, or Oliver did, <laughs> thanks to Felicity's help. And then we cut to, they found out that um, he was stealing the Sig H1. I think that's right. So Felicity is trying to piggyback on Archer, but it's currently offline, but once it goes online, they'll be able to get a location. So Oliver gets Diggle the papers, and basically uh, he finds out that his dad was actually negligent and not like how he was supposed to be, like, you know, everything was been alluded to. Then we have a flash forward scene where they got a power module and uh, Mia and uh, John Diggle do your... John Diggle steps on, they bond, and then they run for it because uh, JJ had a message for him. <laughs> then we have the present day where um, they managed to get a location, and Emiko and the Knights are at the location as well, and then Oliver and company show up. A really cool fight scene, then Felicity got locked out, so Felicity is going to terminate the entire program. And so, um, <clears throat> then it's Oliver versus Emiko, you have like a really incredible fight scene. And then Oliver tells Emiko about like everything that's that's happening and you know how the guy that she's supposed to trust so much lied to her and off to her mother. His her mother yeah. And then we cut to where Diggle, um so then Emiko escaped and then Diggle thinks Stuart and they leave on good terms. He's like, One last thing, call your mother. <laughs> 
Demikatsu was his partner, DL the, um, the root code for Archer, and they might rebuild. It's kind of up in the air. She could, she wants to do something kind of different, but I feel like that's what they're going to go back to. Then we Flash War scene where the Galaxy 1 has Archer on it, so if they have an army of that, they are screwed, and then we see an army of those um, androids. By the present day, we're Emiko off the guy, and that's in the episode. Um, I gave this a strong A, so my thing is, since I don't know if Diggle's last name is going to be is Stuart or not, because um, Diggle said he left when he was 18, so I don't know if, they're, if um, his name got changed to Stuart when he was younger, so I don't know about that. Because they might try to throw in a Green Lantern thing in there. Because, you know, it's just see like John Stewart, John Diggle. So, I don't know what's going to happen. But that might be like a nod to that. So, anyway. Um, it's going to be very interesting to see what happens with that. And um, I love the fight scenes in this episode. And just the whole build of the story. And... You get to see the little seeds of doubt that Oliver plays in Amika about the guy and the fact she just went ahead and offed him. I was like, what? <laughs> but anyway, really good episode. Really enjoyed it. And that's going to do for this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below. Tell me what you think. Do you agree or disagree? Just send your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Helps out the channel a lot. And I'll see you on next video. Bye, everybody.